Yakima PD shelter. No reported hauntings last night. Actually slept well. So now I got about a little over 15 miles to get to where I'm planning to stop for the night, which will give me like a three and a half, four mile push into Parisburg. I've been hiking on and off for the last week with a section hiker soldier and he actually lives there and his truck is parked at the trailhead so if he decides to stop at the same place looks like I got a ride into town if not it's only a couple miles should be able to get a hitch it's amazing how you know I've been out here 60 days and everything is uh, starting to fall into place as far as getting everything together in the morning and getting a routine down and now I've got this water crossing that looks like it's gonna be fun because there are no rocks and it's pretty high so let's hope my feet don't get wet because it's still cold out this morning okay I made it across no wet foot so yeah, you start getting down a routine and everything just becomes boom, 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 boom. Do a quick double check, make sure you got everything and we're ready to rock and roll. Got a little late start today. It's about 8 o'clock. Usually I'm out by 7.30, but I don't have too many miles to do today, so figured take it easy. Had some coffee and some oatmeal. Nice warm breakfast. And uh, we got a big climb coming up. Fortunately, it's in the morning. I like to do those climbs and get them out of the way. And we'll talk to you later. That climb out of Wapiti is no joke. It's almost straight up. Hopefully, the rest of the climb, we're only about halfway into it, won't be quite as bad. Little side trail to this rock outcropping. And oh my goodness, what a view. We're coming up on Doc Knob Shelter, and this is one shelter that's certainly been upgraded. They built a deck on it. Okay. So while I was at that shelter with a really nice deck built on it, soldier showed up and he said, you know what, I'm just going to push on home. And if you want to push with me, uh, just come along and I, my truck's at the trailhead and I'll drive you to town. So I just pushed it out with him and in a way I'm kind of glad I did because he ended up injuring his knee again. So I just stuck with him just in case anything were to happen and we got down okay and uh, his knee started feeling better and then uh, he gave me a ride to a hotel. Now it's not the hotel I'm staying in tomorrow night that I made the reservation for, it's one just a little bit away so tomorrow I'll move over to the other one and tomorrow I'll get my resupply done at the food line which is right across the street and get my laundry done. But tonight, I got into town late, but I was able to go to Dairy Queen, get a nice dinner, and now I'm just hanging out, and Tuesday we'll push on. Got some exciting stuff coming up. A uh, few days, we'll be hitting uh, Dragon's Tooth, and then after that, McAfee Knob and uh, Tinker's Cliffs. So I'm really looking forward to this next stretch.